A recent string of fires in the Martin community of Floyd County is proving taxing for the fire department, both in equipment and in manpower. As a volunteer department, it really hurts us. I mean, we don't get paid for it, so this is all of our extra time, not to mention the manpower we have. If it hits during the time somebody's at work, we just end up shorthanded. Plus, you know, all of us has got, majority of us has got full-time jobs. So, like, I'm working on two and a half hours, and I've just got off my regular job because I had to go in at six and got home at one. So it's very taxing, especially on on us. The recent fire Thursday evening at BRC Trucking also took its toll on the fire department's equipment, equipment that is costly and not easily replaced. Yes, where they had all kinds of uh, hydraulic oil and actually oil stored there, it ended up spilling out. We have ended up losing like in between 15 and 20 sections of holes and seven pairs of gears that's got oil on them so they're no longer able to be used on fighting fires so that that puts us on our limited budget we have anyways from the tax district to replace these fire department officials say that the nature of several of the fires is suspicious and that they are under investigation uh, we we have some suspicious fires that's going on in martin it's unclear if one individual's actually the perpetrator but KSB is actually investigating it. We didn't determine them, but we definitely determined that they was fully suspicious and foul play was very possible in them. So we've definitely turned those two over to them. With the holiday weekend fast approaching, firefighters say they just hope to get through the weekend safely with no calls. Reporting from Martin for EKB News, I'm Jackson Latta.